this 25 pound package is a 12 foot kayak. Want to know how you go from an idea in your head to an actual shipping product that can take people on the water in the bay and the ocean? So cool. We talked to the founder, Anton Wilson of Oru Kayaks, about how he made his idea come to life. This Texilla Maker Fair coverage is powered by Toyota. Let's go places. Anton Willis, Oru Kayaks, one of the coolest Kickstarter projects I've ever seen, probably because I like playing in the water. How do you end up with a folding kayak? <laughs> well, it all started a few years ago. I moved into a studio apartment and had to put my kayak in storage. And at the same time, I read this magazine article about origami and just started wondering if I could actually design a kayak that would fold up like a piece of paper. And I noticed, I, I believe you, you started this out of the tech space. Did you start with actual cardboard models? Yeah, I actually did start with paper models. Um, just to test out the fold pattern, and I've actually pretty much stuck with that for, uh, found it's actually the best way to, to design the form and the fold patterns rather than software. I've done the same thing with welding. It's so much cheaper than cutting the full materials over and over again. Yeah. Where Did you do this out of uh, the tech space? Yeah, I started this actually before Tech Shop opened in San Francisco, but uh, as soon as they opened that location, I joined, and for the last couple of years, it's been a, a huge resource for, for getting this off the ground. So how many design evolutions did you go through on this? There have been about 25 design iterations. How many have hit the water? <laughs> all of them have hit the water. The first one sank. Since that, they've all floated. This is a good progression. Yeah. So I'm curious. It's, it's 25 pounds, 12 feet long. What's the weight capacity? The weight capacity is about 300 pounds. We've actually uh, <laughs> we've had 430, but that was uh, three people standing on it, so we wouldn't really recommend that most of the time. Not the normal. It's not a stand-up paddleboard. No, no, that's... Uh, it's a little long for a squirt boat, a little short for an open ocean boat. Is this like the classic lake, river, bay touring kayak? Yeah, it's primarily a uh, sort of wreck touring hybrid for flatter water. Um, but that said, it, it performs quite well on moderate waves and surf. And in a way, it was designed for the San Francisco Bay, and that's, that's a pretty great place for it. It's an awesome place. where I, yeah. One of the people in the booth said they had actually done some whitewater kayaking with it, hit some rocks, no problems yeah. with it holding together. The form factor and just the hydrodynamics aren't designed for whitewater, so we wouldn't necessarily recommend that. Mm -hmm. But we did do testing as part of our durability testing, and it, it sailed through with flying colors. So, Sweet. Yeah. What's it made out of? It's made out of a heavy-duty corrugated polypropylene. It's sort of a, a much more durable version of what they make the U.S. Postal Service boxes out of. That's awesome. So you guys are making these in California? Yeah, the manufacturing is in Southern California. Uh, the company is based here in San Francisco. $850, do so they start shipping? There's shipping to Kickstarter customers next week. And if you ordered one now, it would be a couple months of lead time. That's not a bad deal. Where do people go if they want to order an Oru Kayak? Uh, go to orukayak.com, and uh, that has everything. Anton, thanks so much for your Take time. Care. Take care. We want to thank Toyota and the 2013 RAV4 EV for bringing us to Maker Fair. There is some amazing stuff going on here, and we're going to show you as much as we can. And we want to take a look real quick at the 2013 RAV4 EV. Capacitive touchscreen controls, which means touch of a finger. You can set the AC up, change your radio station, and of course, 103 mile range, no emissions, all batteries all the time. Seriously, all electric, all SUV. 2013 RAV4 EV. We want to thank Toyota for bringing Techzilla to Maker Fair. Let's go places. There's some cool stuff here.